Welcome everyone, here is how you add a reminder on your calendar. So first step is you're going to open up the reminder app. So from here, if you have a reminder that you want to add today, you can just long press to create an event like so. Okay, but the better way is you see the plus button, just tap on the plus. Now we're creating an event and we can choose all the detail. So title, let's say, I don't know, play Fortnite. I wouldn't recommend you do that, but let's say that's what you want to do. You can set the location, you can set who you want to be calling, etc. if you would like to. If the reminder is an all day reminder, you can select this one here. If you have, you know, a certain day or certain time, you have the start and end, tap on the time to change the time and the date to change the date. Make sure you do this for both the start date and the end date. You have repeat. So let's say you set this to the 29th of August, we'll start today, it's a Monday, and you go to repeat. You could say every week, repeat, and so every Monday, that reminder will drop, okay? You can also set a custom one here as well. You can also select the travel time, all right? If you would like to as well. And then you also have here the calendar. So right now, uh, I'm going to have a purple event because it's in the work calendar. I'll show you how to add calendars, but the problem is with a calendar, okay, is you have to manually add them. Uh, the color is going to be one color. You can't just change for each. Don't worry, I'll cover that in a bit. You can also invite people to this event as well. And you can also add an alert, right? Because we're adding a reminder, we want the ding, ding, ding. So you can have, add the time of event and then how long you want before. And you can also show as busy or free as well. If you need an attachment to be added, you can add that. You can add a URL to your event and notes as well. So once you're ready, let's just tap on add. And so we have the event right here. So remember when I was saying the calendar colors, look at my calendar, it looks quite nice. If we tap into calendars, you can just tap on add calendar you can add a new calendar, okay, change the color, all right? So let's tap into the event itself, tap on calendar, and if you created that new calendar, you select it with a different color, and it will change the color just like that. Of course, see, you can also edit the event, and you can delete it as well. If you have a URL and a t uh, you know attachment, uh, etc., this will show up here, okay? And you also have all the details just like this. So I'm going to delete all future events so that uh, will be removed because obviously, you know, I have my own calendar. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.